By a vote of one to zero, Jordan, you have been evicted. Brittany, in at the end, did two in a row super fast. Look at this smile. She's so excited. She's guaranteed a spot in the freaking final two. Oh my gosh, Brittany. Brittany, Brittany. Oh man, so good. Brittany has played a freaking awesome game. Brittany deserves this, man. She's played an incredible game. Congratulations, Brittany. You, got, you are guaranteed a spot in the final two. She's super stoked. So yeah, it is going to be Janelle who is like, oh my God, am I going to get third place again? Guys, can you imagine if she got third place right now? Can you imagine? Oh my God, that would just be crazy. I did not come here for second place. I've done second place. This has got to be the time that I win. Man, I do not know, man. This is crazy. It's crazy, and I'm so excited to see it. So um, I'm going to do one whim each. One whim. So she wants to be mischievous. Okay, let's do it. So she's going to be mischievous with Janelle. At this point, Janelle does not going to decide her fate. So we're going to do uh, mischievous. She's going to do what's that spot. Oh, oh, and they, she's like, I do not like you. They clearly don't like each other, <laughs> but she's very happy now because she did that. So good for you. And then she wants to go play chess. I know I just said I was going to do one, but I think that this is what Danielle needs to do. She needs to go play chess and she actually, she's going to go ponder moves. She's going to go ponder moves. She's gonna be like, yep, I need to just go think about the game. It's getting down to the wire. It's all, it's out of my hands at this point. I didn't win. Brittany's the only one that can decide. Level up her mischief skill. That's a big ask. How, how, how high is your skill? Um, yeah, that's not happening, girl. That's not happening. But you do want to watch a foosball game. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of both of those. And we're gonna try for new ones. She wants to play foosball and be mischievous. <laughs> like, did they did they even change that much? Nope. Jordan's calling us. That's depressing. Okay, so, um, yeah, let's go ahead and play some foosball. She's going to practice. She's going to practice just in case. I don't know. I don't know what she's practicing for. <laughs> she's crazy. Brittany. Wow, Brittany came up here to talk to Danielle. Danielle needed some space, but Brittany is clearly thinking something because she came up here to talk to Danielle and not Janelle. Just saying. Interesting. Guys, it's time to vote. Oh my gosh, Brittany, it is time to vote. She is literally about to decide who is going to go into the final two. I'm freaking nervous. <laughs> I'm freaking nervous. Oh man. Who do you guys want? Say it now or forever hold your peace because it is literally about to happen. It is about to go down. I don't even know. I honestly can't even tell you who I want it to be because between Janelle and Danielle, they both played a phenomenal game. Both have been head of household a gazillion times and they both deserve to win. So I actually really don't know who I want her to vote uh, or I want her to vote. I'll kind of know when the vote comes up because I'll know if I'm happy or not. But I'm actually really happy it's not Brittany. All right, Brittany, this is it. She's about to cast the one and only vote. By a vote of one to zero, Danielle, you have been evicted. Dane! Oh my gosh, Danielle! I get it, you know? She, she must feel like she has a better shot at winning against Janelle. Brittany, thank you very much for your vote. You can please leave the room. And actually, before you do, Oh, Danielle, my favorite. Honestly, I think Danielle was probably definitely one of my favorites this in, this year, for sure. She made the game so much more fun. There were times where I hated her because I was like, girl, you've won too much. But like, no, she, like looking back, I think she was really an underestimated player. 
and did really well. She deserved to win, man. But you know what, though? I think at some point, too, Dan like Janelle, the curse of the final three. I mean, she finally broke it. It was Sims' version, but she finally broke it. That's a good thing. That's a good news story right there, too. Moment of silence. Moment of silence for Danielle. And she's, like, looking a little serious. Again, she's looking at Brittany like, did you keep me? I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you, and I want to know if I'm safe. I'm safe, right? Yeah, I'm safe. <laughs> Actually, um, no. <laughs> you ain't. You got evicted. She's still unsure. She's still looking at, like, at Brittany. She's like, did you keep me safe or not? Oh, Jordan! Why? You're ruining the moment. This is a very sad, intense moment. <sighs> okay. Well, clearly it ain't that, that much of a dramatic moment. Okay, we're gonna um, lock door for unlock and then lock for everybody but Danielle. Danielle, ask Jordan to leave. Ask her to leave. I should have changed the traits to private dwelling. I don't want visitors, thanks. Just get out, man. I'm trying to film my eviction. Thank you. Jeez. Final two, guys. She's super stoked. She's like, oh my god, this girl saved me when I evicted her two rounds ago. Yeah, she did. Did you make the right decision, Brittany? This is the moment of truth because you are going to win or lose with this decision. <laughs> Guys, the Diva Alliance. That was the winning alliance. There were so many different alliances in this game. Definitely the power of friendship got these two girls to the end. They were a Diva Alliance from early on. And uh, even though... They had a rocky road. It wasn't smooth sailing the whole way. They ended up making it work, and they got to the final two together. So, I mean, obviously something worked out for these two, which is good. Can you guys do something fun? These are the fallen house guests. We only have two left. I liked Brendan more towards the end because I felt like he started to build up his character a little bit. Rachel, I loved, like, she was just a hot mess, and she just really changed a lot of the like really created a lot of drama as well as allison i felt that, that she did a lot will first out and he was definitely someone that i thought would make it farther and also had a lot of drama too um obviously danielle and jordan i mean those were two re i really loved them um and then these four these four are probably my least favorite um, Danielle, the moment that she had that I liked was when she was in the clown suit. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, these four didn't really do much for me. Dan, Jeff, Dan Danielle, and, um, Jesse. These two are just, like, talking. They're not even, like, doing anything other than just talking. Screw this. I feel like we should just bring in the jury. All of our little evicted house kids are coming back in. It's like ring, ding dong, what? They're back. Final nine, we had Allison Irwin. Followed by Rachel Riley. Jeff was evicted in the final seven. Dan, final six. Brendan. Oh, I just realized all three guys went back to back. Final five. Jordan, final four. And who, where is Danielle? Oh, Danielle's like, I'm already in the house, Stu. What are you talking about? I never should have left. I never should have left, but final three. Are they just gonna come in on their own? Nope, they're being really annoying. You guys are so fun. What did the jury house do to you? What did it do to you? Oh my gosh, guys. I forgot to turn this back on. <laughs> I was like, why are these two being so boring? The final two were being so boring that we ended up bringing the jury back sooner. Um, I clearly forgot to turn full autonomy back on. Jeez Louise. Rachel, what does she want to do? Do something romantic. Okay, let's do it. Okay, so she's going to do something romantic with her hubby. Okay, so let's go ahead and romantic. She's going to ask a risque question because she's just like that. She's fully open about her risque-ness. You know what I'm saying? And he's like, ooh, <laughs> yes. Okay, and then maybe they can go and have a woohoo in the closet because they, you know they're going to do it anyway. Might as well just get it done early. You know what I'm saying? What does she want to do now? Be funny with Brandon? No, you're going to woohoo with Brandon. Okay, so let's go look at um, who do we have? Allison. What does she want to do? She wants to pour a drink. Definitely pouring a drink for you, girl. Uh, she's going to, yep, pour a drink. We're going to have a lot of different shots here because <laughs> they're going to get drunk before they vote. That's just how it is. 
They're going to get a lot of juice going. And she also wants to make an enemy? No problem. Rachel, prepare to be... Oh. Okay. Sorry, guys. I'm interrupting there. So, uh, Allison is going to make an enemy with um, Rachel when she's done in here. This is so cool. It's first person view, guys. I've never used this before. Oh my gosh. This is neat. What are you doing, Brittany? What are you doing? Hey, Dan. Are you voting for me to win? She's going to follow Dan. Hey, Dan. Wanted to talk to you about the vote. So, who are you going to vote? Oh, I'm eating. <laughs> it's kind of awkward. We're not even talking. Hey, yeah. Are you voting for me to win? <laughs> That's hilarious. What happened to her head? Oh, that was scary. Janelle's like, I'm outside all alone. And Brittany's like in there. And she, like, I should get out of the pool right now. Man, I should go and try to get some jury votes. What am I doing? This is the final two. Hey, Allison. Bye, Allison. I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> oh God, those people. I might as well just go upstairs. Let me just go play chess. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. I'm gonna go play chess. Just go hang out by myself again. Because I'm cool like that, you know? I don't need people. <laughs> oh my god, her head's gone too. Oh god, it's crazy. Oh, hey, it's Jordan. Girl doesn't deserve fourth place. Oh, what are we doing out here? Bees. Oh, this is cool. They're enraged. I'm going to get stung. This is probably stupid. I'm getting stung. And I'm gonna piss them off. Oh my god, this really hurts. I'm getting really stung. <laughs> She's crazy. Allison's just crazy. Why would you do that, Allison? Allison, let's make an enemy. I think they're probably already enemies. So we're just gonna argue with her. Oh, she's throwing it. She is already in it. And he's just watching his woman get beat. Or, or will she win? <laughs> that, oh, whoa. Allison looks like she's winning this right now. Oh, shoot. What's happening right now? Oh, Allison won. And she is feeling super confident now. Oh, geez. This is going to be bad. And now he's, she's going to go fight Brendan, I'm pretty sure. Yep, she's going to fight him too. Okay, who else can she fight? Who else does she not like? Oh, she doesn't like Jordan. Okay, Jordan, you're the new enemy. Sorry, girl. But you... you Is this... Al, is this... Who is this? Oh, this is Jordan. Wow, Jordan is swimming pretty fast. She's like committing right now. Girl... Girl, girl, can you slow down for me to like be mean to you? Thank you. Fight. She got beat up. Okay, let's do it. She's dazed though. She might not do well in this. Oh, I wonder what it looks like to fight like this. <gasps> oh my God. Jordan, I'm gonna get you. I hate you so much. I'm squeezing your head. Oh shoot. Oh man, where are you? I can't even see you. Oh my gosh. Wow, that was intense being in the middle of that fight. She's beaten twice. Okay, well, we're just gonna declare you an enemy now. Declare enemy. I hate your guts. Couples Alliance, go die. Oh, wow. That's really fighting words, girl. That's fighting words. Oh, my gosh. Allison, you went through this game making three enemies. Oh, jeez. She's got some issues. Um, Like, what are her traits, guys? Like, what are Allison's traits? I forgot how fun it was to play with her. She's mean, evil, and hot-headed, and dastardly. Well, that's a sick combination right there. That's a sick combination. No wonder she has no friends. Okay, so um, Janelle's now talking about the vote, maybe. Like, so what are you thinking? Uh-huh. Okay, just vote for me to win, okay? <laughs> I'm serious. Man, I cannot believe that I almost won Big Brother. Almost. But what is wrong with my eyebrows? Oh my god, it's a tragedy. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna forget about it. Final three. Didn't win again. Oh, whatever. What am I doing? It is now time to start the vote for e or eviction. Gosh, wait, no, 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 no. It's time to start the vote for the winner, guys. And as Allison was the first one on the jury, she will be the first one to cast her vote for the winner. So the difference between this time and all the other times is now you want to see your name actually pulled up on the wheel because this means that they're voting for you to win. Thank you for this. Well, it only took five years but we finally got here. Wow. Here we go. Allison's vote for the winner is...
Brittany, she voted for Brittany to win. Okay, that is awesome. So that means Brittany has one vote. Thank you so much, Allison, for voting. You can go here. Rachel, you can actually go cast your vote to evict. So Rachel, let's take a look at her relationships with the Sims. I don't know if she was really close. So, so Dan, like Janelle, she doesn't even have any relationship with her at all. And Brittany, like she has a little bit of relationship with her, but she also played the game with Brittany twice, didn't she? Or at least once. Yeah, she played the game with Brittany once. So who knows what Rachel's thinking? I mean, let's be honest, she's a little bit of an odd ball. So is she gonna vote for Brittany or is she gonna vote for Janelle? That's the question. All right, so Rachel has voted for Janelle. The only thing that I can think of here is the fact that Rachel is an absolute competitor when it comes to like any competition. She always wanted to win and she must really also respect the fact that Janelle is like that. Rachel to me also seems kind of like more of a bitter jury person. So maybe she's just bitter that Britney beat her. Which is possible. So, Rachel, go here. Leave the diary room, please. Thank you. Oh, my God. Brittany, are you sleeping? Brittany is sleeping. Girl, it is the final vote. They are literally deciding if you're going to win this game or not. And you are up, too. Can you please get it together? Thank you. So, Jeff, it is time to vote for eviction. This is a little bit less dramatic, Jeff, because you were that close to the diary room already. But whatever. We'll just go with it. All right. So, Jeff is like, I am ready for this. It's only taken five years to get here, um, but yeah, I'm ready. Okay, thank you for that. I appreciate it. Okay, so um, yeah, Jeff, let's take a look at his relationships real quick. So Jeff is um, ish close with Brittany. Janelle, he's closer with. So will he go based on friendship or will he go based on strategy? Who knows? Wow, Brittany is up three votes to nothing. Three votes to nothing. Holy crap. She's like he she is literally killing Janelle right now. She is killing Janelle. Three votes. Zero votes for Janelle. Damn. Jeff, you can now leave the diary room as well. Okay, so let's see. Who was next? So it was Dan. Brittany and Dan hate each other. Janelle, he likes her a little bit, I guess, but Dan is like a ruthless player. Like he wants to win at all costs. So will he respect what Brittany did to win the game? Or does he think that she's kind of weak because you know, she didn't take out Janelle when she had the chance. But I mean, clearly it was kind of the right decision. I mean, she at least got three votes so far. She only needs one more to win. Will Dan be the deciding vote? Will Dan be the one that wins it for Brittany? Or will this get a little bit more tense, guys? He's like, I don't know. I don't know what to do, Stu. I'm still still figuring it out. Yeah, he's looking at it. He's looking at it. Oh my, like literally I thought Brittany won. I literally was about to be like, oh damn, but oh damn, that was right on the line. Like he, he was really wishy-washy. He was not set at all in that vote. Like that was crazy. Janelle is on the board with two vote or wait, wait janelle's on the board with one vote and Brittany currently has three. Oh wait is it two two <laughs> who voted for janelle five minutes earlier all right so rachel has voted for janelle oh yeah she did <laughs> oh my god guys i've been talking about the fact that Brittany has three votes she only has two my gosh i am so dumb so now it's two two <laughs> It is two votes for Brittany, two votes for Janelle. So it is actually really tense right now. Everything is on the line right now. Like this is it. This is damn. There's three votes left. Who's going to win? Dan, thank you very much for voting and thanks for tying it up. You're making it really interesting. Okay. So who is next after Dan? It was Brendan. Janelle voted to keep him. Remember that, guys. Janelle voted to keep him. So who knows, man? Who knows? Okay. Oh, he's drinking. He's like, I'm just gonna do this drunk. No, 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 dude, you are not leaving here. What are you talking about? Go sit down, go sit down. He's like totally, dude, dude. Perfect, he is now ready. He's excited, look at them, look at him. Look at that smile, he's ready for this. He's ready for this game to be over. Who is he gonna vote for, guys? 
All right, so Janelle just got a third vote, guys. It's 3-2. Janelle is currently in the lead. There's only two votes left. Damn. So Brendan voted the same person as his girl, Rachel. Will Jordan follow suit? Will she vote the same as Jeff? Brendan, thank you very much. You can leave the diary room. And now it's Jordan's turn. Jordan is talking to Danielle. Look at this. And Brittany. Oh, what does this mean? What does this mean? Jordan, please cast your vote for eviction. So if we're looking at Jordan right now, she um, obviously loves Jeff, so she values his advice. She's closer to Brittany than D Janelle, but she's close to all the finalists, man. She did a really good job socializing in the final four, man. Dang. Dang, dang, dang. Okay. So it is Jordan's vote. Like I said, will she match her hubby or will she vote for Janelle, giving her the final vote she needs to win? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. It's Brittany. It's Brittany, bitch. <laughs> yes, Brittany. She's back in it, man. It's 3-3. Three, three. Oh, my gosh. This is crazy. Jordan, you can now leave the diet room. So... Brittany, you need to change out of your pajamas. Come on, it's the finale, man. It's the finale. At least wear your trademark shirt or something. And Janelle and her are still talking. Girl, like the game is over, basically. You can just stop, you can just stop. Okay, there we go. So, it is Dan Danielle, you okay. Danielle, you're gonna walk all the way over here before I start this, okay? Because I want you to take a long ass walk and you're not wearing that. No, no, that's, I don't even know why I put you in this. Is this pets? It looks like a pets outfit. Like we're not in pets LP, I'm sorry. Danielle, please cast your vote for eviction. So Danielle was the final three. You know, she literally just got evicted by Brittany. Is she gonna hold this against her or is she gonna vote for her to win? And we have Danielle, like technically she's closer with Brittany than she is with Janelle, but does she also respect Janelle's gameplay? I don't know. And she's really close with Jordan. She's really close with Brendan and they voted differently. So who knows what she's gonna do? She's like a wild card, guys. This is the this is it. She's like, I love having all the power. It's my vote. Okay, do okay, girl, you gonna sit? Okay, I think you need to be reset. Where'd you go? Oh wow. Girl was like, I want to walk this twice. I need to walk this twice because I am literally the almighty powerful Danielle right now. So who knows what she's going to do, guys? I have no idea, but it's going to be interesting. And we're going to have a winner. Girl. <laughs> Are you serious? Can you not sit? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. There, she, now she's happy. She's like, I had my moment. I had my two walks to the final diary room where the final vote is gonna be cast this season. Mm, yes, mm. <laughs> All right, so here we go. The winner of Big Brother season two is Janelle! <laughs> Janelle has won! So Janelle has won. She is the winner. Um, you know, obviously, even if you guys weren't a huge fan of uh, Janelle, she did do a really good job. I mean, look up how, how many competitions this girl won. You know, she she was the Vito's, I mean, the Vito's player, the the viewers player. She won tons of competitions. She was vetoed off the block if she was on it all the way up until the final four, you know? So, I mean, definitely did a good job there. And even though Brittany did a really good job too, final two is still amazing in itself. And I think at the end of the day, Brittany was kind of like, she really came back into it and really had a good story at the end of it. So, and she made every part, guys. She made every part, so who really cares? Like at the end of the day, they made every part. Janelle is the season two winner. Let me know in the comments below if this is something that you're really happy about or if you're totally bumming. 
or if you kind of expected it. <laughs> I think a lot of people said it's kind of predictable because we can veto and everyone loves Janelle and we've just been keeping her in the game a lot. So let me know what you guys think of that. But yeah, literally this season's over. Thank you so much for watching this entire Let's Play. I know it's taken a long time to get here, but that will not happen next season. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next part or the next season.